Lydia from Toy Box. I want to show you guys Toy Box, the 3D printer for children. Uh, we look at it as a creative platform for children, so we enable them to make their own toys. Uh, so in this little piece of machinery is very special. We actually uh, couple hardware and software together. And we also make our own models to make sure that they print really, really well on the machine. Uh, you can actually control the machine through uh, our application, our responsive website. Oh, uh, cool. Because we're at CES, we actually have our own network just to make sure there's no big bugs or anything like oh, yeah. that. There's um, little bugs, though. Huh? You have little bugs. We do have little bugs. There you go, the cockroach. So <laughs> this is a mobile website that is connected awesome. to our local network. Um, so we're going to print one toy. So why don't we print the toy box keychain right here. We're going to hit print me, and you'll see that instantly. We'll go over here. Oh, nice. You'll see it moving. You can see it saying preparing, beaming down the toy. I like the little screen, that's cool. Yeah, it's super nice. So now it's heating. Um, through here, you can also control, you can change the ink, you can change the Wi-Fi connection, you can add different accounts, and you can control it all remotely from the application or the website. Nice, nice. Um, what you saw right now, this is the actually the catalog modality. We have three different types of modalities. Uh, the catalog modality, the other one is uh, you can actually use some of our toy apps to create something like this. Uh, this is our block body. You can actually create it with our avatar generator. Oh, so cool. you can think of it as like a emoji or uh, something where you actually make your own action figure and then you can print it. So nice. you can uh, change the eyes, change the nose, change the hair, and then you can actually print it and it prints in different pieces. Oh, that's pretty and cool. you can use the connectors to put them together. Nice. Uh, and the really cool thing is that it's uh, they're all interchangeable. Oh, so nice. you can actually grab, let's say, the arm and then put it in the castle. Oh, that's cool. Right? Um, we also have castles and other things, so you can make it you know, as big as possible. And then there's the last modality where you can actually import your own custom models. So you can actually you know, do it the same way, uh, operate the machine the same way you would operate any other 3D printer, where you actually you go to Thingiverse and you upload your model, or you go you mm -hmm. create your own model you know, with the CADding system, and then you upload it. Nice. Uh, and we have the really cool feature that we have our own, uh, we have our own cloud. So you can start all the models there. Nice. So if you were to, you know, edit the model later, you can do that or actually reprint it. Are these shipping now? Uh, yeah. Oh, there. Yeah, so yeah. these are production then. Uh, so this one is uh, one of our previous models, but it's very close. Um, this one is the one that is the, that we're selling. Oh. Uh, it looks about the same. Is this one bigger? No, it's the same size. Oh, okay. Same size. It's really, really tiny, but it's like metal. There's some yeah, other yeah, ones yeah, out there that are solid. plastic. Yeah, yeah, solid yeah. as a rock. And, uh, so it's a toy box. Yeah, we're currently selling it on uh, Indiegogo. Indiegogo. Nice. How much? Uh, Two ninety. And then we're also selling them on our website, Make Got Toys. Nice. www.make.toys. Awesome. Thank you. Nice to meet you, Andy. Hey, nice to meet you. Let me uh, go out of this.